What's going on, buddy? It's your brother for taking action. Guys, before I start this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. Use all my affiliate links, support the channel, all that good shit. Without further ado, let's get to the review. Found these at Walmart. Walmart's coming in clutch, guys. Big game energy, cotton candy, and sour gummy. Super excited about these. Yay. I guess there's one other flavor that I just didn't get my hands on. So I'm going to do both of these actually today because they're only 150 milligrams of caffeine and I could definitely drink two of these right now and be just completely fine. So without further ado, let's talk about the ingredients. There's 150 milligrams of caffeine. Um, and this is pretty much a pre-workout essentially um, or a gamer, gamer energy drink, you know, big game for gaming, um, could be for hunting, you know what I'm saying? You know, go out, drink one of these, go hunting, shit like that. But when you look at the ingredients, you do have some energy drink and uh, pre-workout ingredients. So you have um, caffeine hydrates, obviously, and then you have tyrosine for focus, uh, alpha size, which is alpha GPC for focus, and then huperzine for focus. So it's really just focus. It's not really a pre-workout. You can use it for this. You can use it for whatever the fuck you want, really. Um, but, you know, I'm just telling you like I see it. I think this is pretty much for either gamers or for, like I said, hunting or pre-workout or just a pick-me-up. It's very versatile, very versatile. So anyways, I like the glitchiness. It looks like an old fashioned type of uh, like video game. And overall, I think this is pretty solid. I like the uh, I like the ingredients and I, I like everything about it so far. So anyways, price points like two bucks, I think, two to 250 maybe at Walmart. I don't remember to be honest, but that's price point. Let's go ahead and try them out. By the way, I'm a big cotton candy flavor guy. Love cotton candy, super excited about this. And sour gummy, how can you not like sour gummy? You know, these are two flavors I really think that if they did well, I would be buying these on a frequent basis. Let's put it that way. So, sour gummy, cotton candy. Let's go and try it out. Taste test time, no artificial colors, anything like that. Without further ado, let's try it out. Cotton candy. Here we go. It actually smells like a pretty good cotton candy. Yeah, taste test. Here we go. Huh. Oh, there it is. Like this flavor is interesting. It's really good. It is, um, it's definitely cotton candy. It goes through like uh, an experience though. Like you get a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Then you get that cotton candy taste. I don't know, it's... It's kind of light on flavor, not super effective and not super like in your face of flavor. It does taste like cotton candy and it is a little bit different than all the other cotton candies I've tried. Um, I just recently tried the Ninja Cotton Candy from G Phil. And that one was a different approach too, a little bit, a little bit lighter. This is also a little bit lighter, but it's got like, I don't know how to describe it, but it's got like, I want to say pink, but I don't know what pink would be. Like pink cotton candy. It's giving me like a pink cotton candy taste. You know, sometimes when you think cotton candy, you think blue raspberry, you think, uh, I don't know what flavor is pink cotton candy. Strawberry? It doesn't taste like strawberry though. I don't know. It's easy to drink, smooth. Definitely would drink it again. Let's go ahead and jump into the sour gummy though. Here we go. Hmm. Here we go. Sour gummy. Hey. All right, so this one, not sour really at all. It's kind of just like a, a little bit of sour, but kind of tastes like lemon, lime. It's definitely giving me like a citrus vibe. 
versus a, 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 a candy gummy taste. I don't know. I'm not really getting much gummy. I mean, a little bit. It's like a gummy lemon lime or something with a little bit of sourness to it. Not bad. I don't know. I don't know if I'm upset or just kind of like I'm okay with it. They're not bad. Pretty good. Definitely um, would drink the cotton candy again. The sour gummy is just kind of just kind of just average to me. Doesn't mean it's not gonna get a bad rating. I've said this before. It's hard to fuck up an energy drink. So they usually get good ratings. You know, they don't get out of the park ratings, but they get good ratings because they're pretty good, you know? So anyways, let's go ahead and rate these. I'm gonna, I am gonna rate these different, probably preference, but then again, I don't think it is because if, if a sour gummy was just as good as the cotton candy, or if they both, oh man, I got some burp action. If they both knocked out of the park, I would give it the same exact rating. This time I'm not. Oh, I get some burp action. All right, so here we go. Cotton candy, I'm gonna finalize this. Cotton candy is gonna get an 8.75 sour gummy. Eight point two five. So that's my rating. So that's that. If you guys have tried this out, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Everything you know in the description box below. We're progressing and we're progressing on that. I'll check you guys later. Yeah.